Hey everybody, it's Bjorn from WP Learning Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a sitemap of your website to your Bing Webmaster Tools to help you diagnose any ranking issues or just to show you how your pages rank and how much of or how many of your pages and images are actually indexed inside of the Bing search engine. So the first thing we do to make this happen is we install a plugin. We're going to use for this tutorial WordPress SEO by Yoast and that's going to create the sitemap for us. And we take that sitemap link and we add it to our Bing Webmaster Tools. So let's do the first part, and that is install that plugin. First thing we do is we log into our WordPress dashboard. We have over plugins on the left and then click on Add New. In the search bar, we type in WordPress SEO by Yoast. And it's the first result in the top left here. I already have it installed, so it says installed for the button. Yours may say install now if you don't have it installed yet. Please do install it and click on activate to activate the plugin. And once you do that, you will see on the left hand side a new item called SEO. And when you hover over that, there is going to be an entry called XML sitemaps. So we're going to click on XML sitemaps. And what SEO by Yoast actually does as soon as it's installed is it creates a sitemap right away. So when you click on this button here, it takes us to the sitemap. Now this sitemap that I have here is a little customized. It has only posts and pages. And you can do that customization within these tabs in the plugin. And I actually go through that in another tutorial video that I link to below this video. So you can customize the sitemap through that if you want to. If the sitemap that you see here without customization is exactly what you want, then that's great. Just leave it the way it is. If you want to customize it a bit, please do so. I only have posts and pages in there because really that's the main content I want search engines to find and index. So that's the only reason I have only posts, only pages. And when you click on these links, it actually has a sub sitemap. So this is all the posts on our website. And if we go back to the sitemap index and click on the pages link, this is all the pages on the website. So it's really two sitemaps in one. It's the post sitemap and the page sitemap. And we want to take this URL and copy it. And we're going to take this over to Bing Webmaster Tools and put it in that system so that we can see how much of our site is indexed within Bing and diagnose any other problems. To get to Bing Webmaster Tools, you have to type in bing.com forward slash toolbox forward slash webmaster or you can use their search uh, search engine to find the Bing Webmaster Tools. we will be presented with this box here and you can either sign up with a new Microsoft account if you don't have one yet. You do need a Microsoft account to activate the Webmaster Tools. Or you click on sign in if you already have a, a Microsoft account. Just going to enter my credentials. And this is the dashboard it's this into. And at the very top, it shows our demo site, which is wp-phd.com. We added this site in another tutorial video that I also linked to below this video if you want to see how to verify your site inside of Bing. If you already have your site verified, then we can jump right in and submit the sitemap. If you haven't verified your site, watch the other tutorial that I linked to, and then verify your site, and then come back to this to add the sitemap. And in fact, during the verification process, you can also add the sitemap. But here we are. We're inside the Webmaster Tools dashboard. This is the profile we want to add the, the sitemap to. And on the left, or sorry, the right-hand side down here, there's a Submit a Sitemap button. All we have to do is click on that, and then we paste in the sitemap URL, and then click on Submit. And then it adds a new entry right here almost instantly. And it has a couple of columns. URL submitted is pending. Last crawl is pending. Status is pending. This should update fairly quickly. I'm just going to refresh the page. It might be updated already. It's not updated yet, but it will update either within an hour or within a few days. And then you'll start to get information about your site as it exists within the Bing search engine. So in this video, you learn how to add a sitemap to your Bing Webmaster Tools. And I hope this video helps you. My name is Bjorn Alpass from WP Learning Lab. Please make sure you like this video if it helped you. Check out our other videos and subscribe to our channel. Check out our social media feeds and check out WPLearningLab.com where we write about WordPress every single day. Talk to you soon.